What about your father? What was he like? My father, my father was a very kind man. Uh, in fact, my father's still alive. He's, he's a very kind man. Um, he's, he's a very quiet man. Um, in fact, he's very shy. Um, not a confrontational uh, person in any way. And when Betty Sue, my mother, um, would go off on 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 a tangent uh, toward my my father, um, and 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 of course in front of the kids, it was no matter to her. Uh, he would he would um, he, he amazingly remained very very stoic and uh, never, as she was rationing him with horrible um, things, he stood there and just looked at her while she delivered the pain, and he swallowed it, he took it. Um, there was never one moment Never a moment when my father um, lost control and attacked my mother or hit my mother or even said even said a bad thing to my mother what what i the things that I witnessed were there were a couple of times when it got too far that I, I would see his, I could see his eyes welling up as he was staring at her, saying nothing. Um, and then the most that he would do is he would, he would, he would punch a, a, a wall. I, I once saw him punch a wall and um, it would shatter his hand because it wasn't, it wasn't drywall, it was um, proper concrete and uh, steel wire and rebar and things of that nature and uh, um, but still never never touched her never um, argued with her he, uh, he 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 remained a gentleman and to me as a five-year-old boy I kept thinking to myself I kept wondering why why does he take it how does he how does he take this and 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 why doesn't he leave her um, but he didn't you know um, he was able to maintain his calm and his composure he was able to maintain uh, his relationship with his children um he was, uh, he, was, he was a good man. He is a good man. You mentioned that you saw your father punch a wall. How many times did you witness that? I mean, out of, out of, I couldn't count the amount of fights that they had, but I, I, I know that I, I've, I've seen my father strike uh, a wall, um, two or three times tops once <clears throat> when he broke his hand um, but yeah two, two two three times at tops you know was your father ever abusive to you or any of your siblings uh, no my father was never my father was not an abusive man um, at the same time, my father was also, um, to some degree, at the mercy of Betty Sue, uh, because if he argued with what she wanted done, that would just turn into uh, a another um, barrage of, of, of hatred uh, towards him. So I can remember 
my father coming home from work and m maybe I'd, I'd, I'd gotten a bad report card or maybe I'd uh, gotten in trouble at school or um, something like that. And my father would arrive home from work and the first thing she would say was, John, take, take him out there. He gets the belt, give him the belt. And he wanted to know what it was about. So he'd take me out to the garage and, uh, I'll never forget the, uh, this white, thick leather 1970s era, thick leather white belt that he would, um, take off and, and, um, and then he would uh, commence to uh, inflict the punishment uh, on on me. Um, but interestingly, there was a, there was one time when my father I I kept telling him I I didn't do this. It was another incident. I, I kept swearing to him that I I did not do what Betty Sue my, what my mom had said. That I'd done, but he went through with the punishment anyway. <clears throat> and then, uh, not long after, he found out that I had been telling the truth and that I hadn't done what uh, I, what my mom had said that I'd done. Um, and he he came to me and uh, apologized to me for um, for having gone through with the whipping, you know, with the belt. And um, I have to say, um, my mom never did that. She couldn't. She she knew what she knew. She was raised how she was raised. And. Um, I had no power to change what was inside of her.